I want to make a quick video. Um, I saw a video where the infamous Nader Ahmed was debating Tony Costa. Tony Costa is one of David Wood's boyfriends. Uh, you know, so basically, I just want to respond to the Satanic Verses. Uh, Tony Costa says that uh, Satan never influenced prophets in the Bible. And that is 100% false. If we read... Uh, if we read 1 Chronicles chapter 21, verse 1, it states that Satan uh, provoked or moved David to take the consensus of Israel. So notice how David, who is considered a prophet according to the New Testament, uh, you know, was provoked or he was influenced by Satan in, two, in uh, 1 Chronicles chapter 21, verse 1. Uh, so this claim that, you know, prophets can't be... Uh, influenced by Satan or whatever is false according to the Old Testament or according to the Bible itself. As to as for the Satanic Verses, the Satanic Verses story is false because, uh, you know, even Ibn Ishaq himself says that the Satanic Verses story is uh, false. So Christians uh, cannot use the uh, Satanic Verses story against the proper moment because even the earliest reporter of the satanic verses says that the satanic verses story is false and i'll pull oh, up, this is uh... i'll pull up the reference right now uh you know ibn Isaac says the satanic verses story is false abu hayyan al andasori mentions about this, about the story imam muhammad bin Isaac, aka ibn Isaac. The compiler of Sira, Sira is the biography of the Prophet Muhammad, was asked, uh, he said, this is from the fabrication of the heretics, and he wrote a book uh, on the issue. This is found in Al-Bakh al-Mahir fi Tafsir, volume 7, page 526. So notice how even Ibn Ishaq himself reported that the Satanic Versus story is false. So Tony Costa is dead wrong on two things. He's dead wrong on prophets not being able to be influenced by Satan. As we've seen in 1 Chronicles, uh, Satan was able to influence David to, uh, uh, to, do, a, uh, to do a numbering or a census of Israel. And two, the Satanic Versus story is false according to the earliest biography, according to the earliest biographer of the prophet Muhammad, Ibn Ishaq. Even Ibn Ishaq himself said that the, satan the Satanic stories, the Satanic Versus story of the prophet Muhammad is false. So, you know, this refutes Tony Costa's uh, proposition or Tony Costa's um, argument against the uh, prophet Muhammad and the uh, satanic versus uh, story. And the, and, the fact, and the fact of the matter is that uh, prophets in the Bible can be influenced by uh, Satan. Uh, so stay tuned. More videos coming up ahead.